Memorial Day is upon us, so today in the News 9 Kitchen, we are making delicious kebabs for the grill for yes. all those fabulous barbecues. And to help us do that, we have Don Hunt from Katrina Aurora. Yes, I'm so happy to be back. I'm How so happy to you? see you. So happy that you're I'm here. I'm so excited. I'm so happy to feed you. Yes. Because I know you love to eat. I do. All the yummy Especially food. things with lots of color. Do you? Love vegetables. Is that? Is that? Yes, that's my thing. Is that your thing? That's the my more thing. color, the better. Yes. And it's so pretty. It's so, it's so gorgeous. Pretty. So you know, we're doing a lot of grilling this weekend. Well, we hope, right? We're gonna have. Uh, we hope we're gonna have some sun. I think yes. I heard we're gonna have some sun. Otherwise, we'll be grilling yes. in the rain. I know. Grilling in the rain. Oh my goodness. We'll do it. No. Oh. Um, so, everybody's doing hot dogs and hamburgers and chicken, but I always love kebabs because yes. they're pretty and they're fun. Easy too. And they make really good leftovers that you yes. can stuff in a taco, which is my favorite thing. So, what we have today is what I call dynamite. Kebabs. Shrimp kebabs, okay. yeah, because we use some of our hot pepper oil to yes. make the marinade. All right. So while I'm talking about the marinade, I want you to build a kebab for me, okay? okay. I'm going we to do have that. sweet peppers, okay. Red onions, yep. Pineapple chunks, okay. Jalapenos, if you're brave, I like them. Jumbo shrimp and avocados, and we're going to build the kebabs using that. Okay. Now the marinade, or the what I like to do is brush it on. It's just lime juice. Uh, cilantro and parsley and then some of our fabulous hot pepper oil. Now if you're not a fan of hot pepper, that's okay. We love you anyway, no judgment. <laughs> um, do you like hot pepper? I do. Okay, this is our hot pepper oil is, it's not super hot. It's not like burn your nose hairs off. It's more of a um, uh, smoky flavor. sweet. Okay. Yeah, I got like a lot that. of flavor. So that looks beautiful. Did I do so, a good job? Yeah, you did a great job. Okay, good. So let's take some of this, this lovely marinade and let's, let's Go ahead, keep building, because oh, we got to keep building. We got to feed the crew. So let's, they're over here, they're really hungry. <laughs> so I promised them they could eat after. So as we're doing this, Don, yeah. tell me what's new. What's new? Oh my goodness, we have a very huge thing happening right now. Mm -hmm. We've partnered with a store, okay. brand new store called Unique Designs. Yes. In the Rockingham Park Mall, it is an artisan gift store. Wow. Okay, local artisans, people like us, wonderful uh, local gourmet foods, okay. uh, artists, pottery, all kinds of great stuff. And this store opens in the Rockingham Park Mall next weekend. Okay. So we're super excited. So you can find our products there and lots of other great things just like Kachina Aurora. Perfect. Look at what a good job you're doing. I'm doing such a good Are job. Are you going to make I'm, these this weekend? I totally am. You know the great thing about this is that you can make them ahead of time. And you can just put them on the grill? Yeah, you can cut them up ahead of time, put and them right on the grill. Before we go, what do we serve yeah. with this? Uh, salads, oh, potato salad Ooh. would be great. Um, a nice green salad. If you want to get crazy, I like a corn and pineapple salsa. Ooh. And then you can serve them even with tortillas because this has a lot of Mexican flavor with the avocado. Perfect. Um, or you can go the other way and just put it on a green salad or by itself out of the fridge. That's oh, right. that's right. Leftovers. John, thank you so much for being here. You are this delightful. Is such a great, this is such a great uh, idea for the barbecue oh, this weekend. Oh, good. I'm glad you liked it. And it's sunny. That's right. We'll bring in the sun. Thank you, Don. We'll Thanks. be right back.